Hey folks, this is Deco here, and welcome back to RimWorld. So, we have a spaceship problem. Specifically, this spaceship. Well, spaceship fragment. Well, whatever. You know what I mean. The point is, it's here and it's poisoning the map, and it's probably full of mechanoids, and we need to make that go away. So that's what we're gonna do. So, let's grab some people and take some sniper rifles to pop the thing open. I think we should be able to uh, take care of it ourselves as is. Octopus and Shrew, that's who I want to have sniper rifles. Um... I think, I think it'll be okay. Let's get everyone in the home zone. Sure, why don't you come grab one of our sniper rifles? Uh, the superior one. I think Octopus. I was gonna get the other one. You've got sleeping sickness, though. What does that do? Oh, that's not bad. Okay. So you come as well and grab uh, this sniper rifle. Sure. Alright, and we've got all the animals flagged to come inside. So they should all be in here momentarily. We'll just wait patiently for them to do so. Come on, Alpaca 2, don't be a jerk. Get over here. Okay, come here. And where'd you go? Shrew, come here. I see you training, and that's awesome, but what I actually need you to do is come over here, and we're going to shoot some robots. So, two of you, come here. Oh, shoot, I've got some animals set on follow. Yep, here we go. Alice 4, go back inside. Thank you. Okay, so, well, let's po just pop this open. There's no real strategy here. We're just going to open it and run away, basically, and kind of see what happens. So let's see what we got going on in here. I'm not super excited about this, but, well, you get what you get. So, fire away. Let's see what we got. Oh, one centipede. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. It's got a charge blaster, which is not quite so great, but it's okay. Why don't you guys shoot at him a little bit? Yeah, we'll be fine as long as we keep some distance. Oh, this is no big deal. Okay. Like, we have a very wealthy colony. We've got seven people and a crap ton of pets. And we're getting, like, ship parts with one centipede in it. I don't totally understand why the storyteller is so convinced that we're weak. Because we are not. We're actually pretty good. I mean, we're not, like, OP or anything, but... Like, we are a force to be reckoned with, even with our stupid bows. I still need to um, get the alpacas trained. The alpacas that I don't care about, the ones that are staying numbered. So that they can be sent off to attack my enemies, whoever they may be. How's this thing doing? Not doing great. We have visitors, that's fine. We'll take care of you in a few moments. Once we take care of this robot abomination. Because that is, of course, what they are. They're probably just full of electrons. Gross. Oh, yeah, and I see our food rotting away. It's fine. I don't care. We got tons of food. There we go. Doing good. Couple more shots. There we go. Nicely done. All right. Let's unrestrict everybody. Oh, yeah. This can be clear force. That's fine. All of you are unrestricted except for combo. Animals. Uh, this is a bit more of a pain. Okay. All on grazing. And then the three of you... On destruction, right? Right, okay. And then let's get you guys swapped back in here for some weapons. Um, equip, and... Uh, equip. Cool! And then we'll have someone come out here who's not very useful. Matt, you're asleep. Why are you asleep? Um, I don't care where you're asleep. Come here. And who else is handy? Tona? I see you harvesting, but that's okay. Come on over here. We can finish this thing off. That's fine. We'll shut it down. Heard somebody's bow go off. I don't know what's up with that. Alright. Come right over here. Destroy ship. Actually, I could just have them melee it. But this is good practice for them. Right? Right. So you guys work on that. Airy, what are you up to? Shutting down the mechanoid. That's fine. Actually, this may take like a million years. Let's have more people come over here. Airy, come here. You can come out. People hanging out, that's fine. I see Graham has started sculpting again, that's fine. We need to get this thing taken down because it's right about to get to our heel root. And I do not want that. So let's get all three of you working on this here. You guys are doing great. 16%. Bows do a number against spaceships. That kind of surprises me. Well done. Alright. Cool. And as one of you guys go by, uh, I don't know, M Matt, come trade. It, it really doesn't matter who decides to trade with you. We'll just leave the robot out there. It's fine. Alright. Anything that you have 
to talk about that we care about. Oh, you'll buy all our crap. <gasps> Yay, you don't have any money, but that's okay. The important part is we'll get rid of some of this stuff. Um, can we have Plasteel Gladiuses? Huh, I didn't even notice that. Um, short bows, short bows, short bows. Junk, junk, junk. We can make way better weapons than that. We'll keep the great bow. And we're gonna keep most of the weapons. The proper weapons. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. You know what? We don't need your gold. We could just buy... Actually, we don't need anything you have. Thanks anyway. Thanks for stopping by, though. I appreciate it. So we need some more meat. Right? Yes, we need some meat. Minor Precris. Yeah, sure, fine, whatever. Here's a turkey. Turkeys are delicious. There's a wild boar, which is delicious. Ambrosia. I don't really care about ambrosia. Monkeys are not worth the effort. IMO. I don't actually know if they are or not, but I wouldn't think that monkeys would be very good eats, so... We'll just eat something else. Let's see here. Turtles, boars... Yep, yep, yep. This is less interesting, sorry. Um... Emus, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. I guess I could just look through here. See, we're still trying to tame small packages. Then we've got this mystery alpha beaver, and I'm not totally sure. Look at all these boomalops. Holy hell. There's a lot of boomalops on this map. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, here. Just go get some cassowaries. I don't, I don't really care. It's fine. Is this the alpha beaver that's over here? Or where'd that guy go? Um, it was in really bad health. Or something. Oh no, it's still alive. Okay, good. Well, I hope that we get an alpha beaver. We don't need an alpha beaver. I just think it'd be funny. Everyone likes alpha beavers. Okay, let's let them catch up with hunting here quick. And how are things going in here? Temperature is nice. Slept in the heat, because of course you did. We discovered that we could already make prosthetics. That's pretty nice. We made combo an arm. Not a great arm, but whatever. We have a prosthophile that can't have a prosthetic, because of course you can't. Ooh, another nice sculpture. A couple of them, nice. Let's keep kitting out this whole base. We'll just make this base amazing. Right? That'll be awesome. Combo, why don't you have a sculpture? And... Who else do I feel like needs a sculpture? All of my colonists broke up. That makes me very sad, I'm not gonna lie. Impoverished. Oh, there we go. Beautiful, okay. I realized that we could make a bunch of small sculptures instead, but I can't be bothered. So, oh well. He'll get to it, that's fine. Well, maybe he won't. He's actually pretty slow. Do you have any modifiers at the moment? Nope. Spacious interior, beautiful. Catharsis, in a little pain. I could replace your arm. Don't tempt me. Now, what are we doing here with the animals? Okay, good. We've got a few more trained. This is good. Oh, a pack of three! Oh no! Come back inside! Um, where are you? Come back into safety. Whew. Glad I noticed that, just in time. I'm confident it was just in time. There's nothing that the animals love more, the wildlife loves more, than to feast upon baby pet flesh. I guess. That's the right way to put that, right? Now uh, you're smoking the meat first. Well, that's mildly annoying, but I guess that's okay. A psychic Soothe. Oh, nice. I appreciate it. Oh, we're out of wood again. I'm not totally sure that having an alpha beaver around is going to be very good for us. In terms of, like, running out of resources, but it'll be funny. And funny is good, right? Especially since I need to start turning on this spaceship. I have been stalling at this for quite a while. Oh, combo's back outside. Well. Um. No, combo, stay in the base. No, you're supposed to be inside. What were you doing out there? Dude. Pay attention. He's relaxing socially, but there's no one else awake except for him. <gasps> His divorce is gone. Oh, thank God. Okay, that is nice. That is going to save us so much trouble. Oh, check this out. The helmet's degrading. Well, it's still, like, being made. That's actually quite funny. Let's fix that. Um, we still got some slate. Let's put a slate wall here. That is really funny. I didn't know things could degrade while they're still being made. That's hilarious. I have like 1,200, 1,400 hours in this game, and I've never actually tested that. Fire? Okay, fire's not good, but 
It's raining. It's fine. It would be nice. Oh, okay, I was just gonna say, if Combo would come build that, that's actually not the nice part, but it's okay. I'm glad he's doing it anyway. There we go. Well done. And someone will get around to the helmet. I don't care. Octopus and Airy should be cooking and butchering. Yep, good, good. And keeping up with Kibble too, I think, right? How's our Kibble looking? They tend to get away from Kibble if I don't, like, focus on them. So let's keep an eye on this. Let's make sure... Actually, will they use smoked meat and kibble? Let's see here. Actually, you know, use insect meat and use human meat if we've got it. Smoked meat. Yeah, okay. They will. I just need to make sure they keep the dogs fed. It's fine. Alright. Graham, what are you doing that's not sculpting? Because that's really all I want you to do. You're cutting down trees. Oh, that's from... Okay, hold on, hold on. We'll come back to that in just a second. That's from when we uh, needed... No, not you. Yeah, you. That's when we needed the... um. The blight stuff. Chopped down. So let's have you guys... Let's deprioritize this in a couple of you guys. Matt, that's actually a good thing for you to be doing. Octopus almost always has something better to be doing through time. Tona and Aerie. <gasps> Hooray! Oh look, they already found a bedroom. Good for you, Ari. Mind you, you and Shrew can't be happy with each other. Actually, they're relatively neutral. Oh, you guys really like each other. Okay, so Combo and Octopus hate each other because it's his ex. Although she doesn't hate him nearly as much. Huh, you guys sure are friendly. Train the alpaca, hooray. I like looking at these combat logs, too. Who's been in combat recently? Yes, a cut to the body caused the caraway, or cassowary to perish. The cassowary's left kidney and body was perforated by hits into bits by octopus's shot. These are just... I love this writing. Wait, who? what was turned into a fine red mist? Hold on. Was pierced into a fine red mist. Oh, that's hilarious. More alpha beavers. Let's try to tame another one. There, you're a boar. You're not a beaver. I don't care about you. Let's try to tame a couple. They'll just get killed, but it's okay. And we'll hunt the rest. I just don't want to deal with them eating all the lumber on the map. Did those others... Let's see here. Um... Yeah. That'll be fine. Good deal. This is fantastic. Ah, the big hunting train. Or no, this is the taming train, right? Come on, sure, you can do this. Alpha beavers are hard to tame. Let's see if she can do it. Using up all our potatoes, but that's okay. 7%? Oh, okay, never mind. I've changed my mind. Never mind. Eh, just go kill him. It's not worth the effort. We have better things to do with our time. Combo's breaking down some more stone. That's nice. Graham, are you getting any better at arting? You're at 11. That's pretty good. It's too bad that you're slow. That's just your movement speed, though. At least you're not slothful or lazy or whatever it is. That's just obnoxious. Because then they do everything really badly. Alright. Let's get some more wood chopped down. I'm trying to think of a way that I can stall and not turn on the ship. Because I'm having fun with this base. <laughs> um, My last excuse was that I wanted Combo's mood modifier to drop. And it did drop. So now it's like, well now what? Oh look! I need to make... Uh, hold on a second. Oh, potatoes are running away. I need to put proper sandbags here, because obviously we can't invite danger when we don't have proper sandbags around the corner. What a terrible idea that would be. I assume someone's going to come take care of that, right? Thank you. Yes. Definitely. We just don't want them to be able to stand there and shoot around the corner. Actually, I should replace these doors as well. Yeah, let's get those pulled out. And we can just put slate in, that's fine. And build copies. Those are going to be a pain with animals walking through it constantly, but it's okay. I love having all these animals, by the way. I think this is hilarious. We are building up quite the alpaca army. Let's see here. Now, actually, I don't know if I want to send you guys out, but all the alpacas that just have numbers, you are going to be ablet of armor. Yes. Not alpaca 3, obviously. Okay. Good. Looking good. Oh, 
Another statue. Poor quality. Well... Um... It's still got some beauty to it. It's 68. That's fine. Why don't you throw it in your own quarters? Then you can look at it and remember why it is that you need to do a better job. That's my new theory. You. Okay, Alpaca's trying to reproduce. That's, that's fine, I guess. I don't love that. Oh yeah, I've got these gladiuses. Who likes combat that is never, ever going to end up um, going crazy? Shrew. Shrew is good at all kinds of things. So why don't you go ahead and come grab a plasteel weapon. Now I've lost it. Here's one. Yep. Come equip as a sidearm. Who else do I really like? I like Octopus quite a bit. Even though I'm not terrible. Oh, she's already... She's got a longsword. That's fine. Airy also has a longsword. Okay. Combo is constantly, like, going crazy. I tell you what. Airy, why don't you just come have this anyway? Drop. And equip his sidearm. Thank you. Ah, yeah, this is a little bit of micro, but it's okay. We'll go ahead and we'll move these things around a little bit here. Matt, Tona. Oh, Matt, you don't have anything at all. Uh, come equip this as a sidearm. Prioritize hauling? No, sidearm. Yeah, sure, you guys all have blades of some kind. That's fine. Okay, we're just about out of kibble. I really need someone to make some kibble. Eri, where are you? I see that pemmican is getting made at a priority over kibble. And that's, I suppose, a reasonable thing to do, but... If that's what's going to happen, then we're going to have to pay more attention to this whole kibble situation. I mean, I can always just let the dogs eat pemmican. It's fine. It's just super labor-intensive. And you're tired, so I'll let you do the stack, and then I'll release you. Thank you. Fair enough. How's your health? 59% and 47. Okay. Oh, yes. We have to wait for her to get healthy again. Obviously. Wait. Combo's smoking meat? I didn't know I had you set on that. <gasps> Look, we're starting to build up some chem fuel. Mind you, we can't build mortars or anything. Even though we have all these cool weapons. We got scyther blades. We got more pregnancies. We got... We got all kinds of things. We got guns. We got knives. We got sharp sticks. Everything's great. So, Aerie is still not wearing... The thing that I want her to wear. Uh, you know what I mean. Maybe you don't. Aerie, you're up. Come here. Making pemmican. No. Need material. Oh, okay. You made enough kibble. Okay. You know, I should set a cap on pemmican, maybe. Kibble doesn't ever go away. Maybe we should just make a bunch more kibble. Let's do that. Let's make some more kibble. Why not? There. We'll make a lot of kibble. Great. And focus on that, please. Need materials. Really? Unpause. There. Now you'll do it, right? Maybe? Visitors. That's fine. Needs treatment. That's fine. Come back inside. Get some treatment. That would be very good. Our grazers are almost keeping up now. That's pretty funny. Not quite, but they're close. Okay, Airy, come tend. Thank you. And then after that, please come make some kibble. Or it looks like you're doing it. Sure and destruction have formed a bond. Now that is fine, because destruction is not going to be used for combat purposes. He's kind of my backup combat guy. Mm. Oh, I forgot we have an incendiary launcher. We should make sure and do something funny with that. I can't think of what, but something. Okay, you don't have anything I care about. Oh, destruction. Ah, you crazy bear. Yeah, you've got, like, permanent scars, like a couple of them. I tell ya. Alright, so what are my other excuses going on right here? Oh, look, another statue. Normal quality. You can have this because there's two of you in here. This is actually kind of fun, just making tons of sculptures. I just wish that it was doing a better job at increasing our wealth. You know, I could just put this one inside. Um, octopus, I like you. Ooh, you know what I should do? Let's do this, since I don't need this other room. Let's turn this into a big ol' hospital- Oh, should I put in two hospital beds? 
Wouldn't that be insane? Two hospital beds. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do two. Cool. And we'll keep going with our wooden floor death trap. Because of course we will. And then I can put a sculpture in there. Everything's going to be great. They're going to love it. Everyone's going to love it. Actually, this needs to go in here. Sorry. You don't get a sculpture. Well, you will get a sculpture. You'll get the next one. Psychic drone. That's fine. Potatoes are rotting away. I don't care. That's really funny that combo's falling through to cooking. Did you guys get rid of those alpha beavers yet? Mm, no. That's okay. Look at all these boomalopes. I seriously want to, like, set off a chain reaction of boomalopes. Maybe the next time it rains, I'll go do that. That'll be funny. I mean, we already have our pet boomalof. Right? The boomalof. Boomalof. Yeah. Where'd he go? I didn't think of a better name, by the way, so here he is. Ooh. Should I use you as explosive armor? Hmm, nah, I don't have enough of you. There's no need to do that. Here, there's a turkey. No, we don't need it. Okay, well. Let's see here. Octopus, how's your health doing? Oh, that's right. That's what I was waiting for. 50%. Oh, my God. Well, 1563, but still. Oh, sleeping sickness is annoying. It's not the worst, but it's pretty bad. I'm so tempted to install this golden sculpture. Maybe I'm not getting value from it because it's not installed. That could be it. That might be it, actually. Let's test that theory. Oh, this is going to make this room so beautiful. I feel like I'm cheating really, really hard. I mean, I just popped it in here because I wanted to increase colony wealth. But now this is going to make this room just spectacular, right? Luxurious. 27,000 wealth. 1,500 beauty. I have never had anything like that. It's amazing. And once again, our coolers have rotted away. Cooler thing is kind of annoying. Alright, we're waiting on the Psychic Drone, we're waiting on Octopus. 64%. Uh... Okay, that's my new thing. I'm gonna say that right here. As soon as... Octopus is healed of her sleeping sickness. We're going to hit the button and power up the starship. That's what we're going to do. Our base is looking pretty amazing. Well, I mean, not indoors. It's horrifying inside. It's just awful. But outside, it is not too shabby. Oh, uh, we need some more stone. I could expand into that empty area that I never expanded into. We're starting to run out of convenient stone, which is kind of funny. I'm turning an awful lot of this into sculptures is what's happening. Connoisseur's treatment. Yep, yep, yep. No worries. You'll be fine. Let's move our bedrooms, maybe. We can do that while we're waiting around. One, two, three, four. I think I've got enough for that. Yep. Yeah, we can do that. Sure, why not? And we'll knock out these walls, and then we'll have... Then we could actually pull these two bedrooms out. You failed, dude. I should turn you off of construction entirely. You're so bad at this. I'm sorry, but you are. You're kind of a liability, but it's okay. Like I said, you lost your wits in brave defense of our colony. Actually, you didn't, but we can pretend that you did. So you, you sort of did. Yeah, see, now you've used up all our materials. <sighs> Actually, we can build one more, so that's fine. But I want him to have something to do, so... Alright. Spoils in 14 days, that's fine. You know what? I'm actually going to suspend the pemmican temporarily. So when I forget about it, and we all starve to death... Remind me and say, hey! Alpha Beaver Revenge? Okay. Well, that's going to go really badly for it, because Shrew has, like, an entire posse. Careful. Careful. Good job. Okay, good. Tona's actually building things now. That's nice. Here, put in walls. Put in flooring. Part of the reason that I think I'm using wooden flooring is because it's just hilarious when it finally catches on fire. 
and your whole base goes poof. It's it's really quite entertaining. You'll just have to take my word on that. Actually, if we're lucky, the base will catch on fire at some point. No limestone. We have slate, right? One, two, three, four. Mental break confusion. Is that going to be Alice again? Yeah. Poor Alice. It's so funny having an alpaca with dementia. I don't know why it's so funny to me, but it is. Okay, get some more flooring in here. Looks like we're going to need some more wood. That's fine. I could put stone in here, yes. But I'm not going to. Although that does mean we need more wood. So let's chop some down. And then, yeah, let's take out those walls and move everything over and blah, blah, blah. We can do that. So, let's move this up here, along with the statue. And we'll move this up here, along with the statue. Perfect, and then we can knock these walls out. We'll have a much bigger room, everything's gonna be great. Fibers mechanoid, seriously? Okay, poor octopus, seriously. Things are not going well for you. Fibrous mechanites take a long time too. Uh, oh well, at least it gives you some bon uh, some benefits along the way, so that's kind of nice. Matt, what's your problem? Rebuffed, dude. Honestly, there needs to be a button that says like stop hitting on people. Because seriously, if I may repeat myself, dude. Don't do that. I missed some floors here. Let's get that fixed. Alright. Well, at least she's got this just amazing room to hang out in. Very impressive hospital. Plus three. Extremely comfortable. Yeah, they're good in superior beds. Nice. What a place, I tell ya. So now, obviously, I can't wait for the fibrous mechanites. Sleeping sickness. 69%. Oh my god. Okay, maybe we're not going to wait that out. Because this is going to take a thousand years. Okay, these need to be hauled outside. Thank you. I'm a little irritated that you never got around to chopping them up, but whatever. There we go. Good job, guys. Now you're making us proud. Alright, how's your next sculpture? Going well. All right, is there any more training we want to do? Not really. Yeah, we're not getting ready into Steve's, so. All right, I tell you what. This is going to take too long. Octopus, how's your health? Crappy. 70% and forever. So. Yeah. I think we'll just flip the ship on here just to get things started. Let's get a couple more hunting things done since we're right here. There's some turkeys right here. Um, just go ahead and get rid of that and get rid of that. We want to make sure that we've got a reasonable amount of food stacked up. I say that as we have 3,684 pemmican. So that's not a great excuse. Um, we need to make sure that we've got a lot of kibble made. Yes, we need lots of kibble. Which I think destruction is now eating, which is funny. But that's okay. Here, we'll put kibble over there too. And then this should be set to like critical. Yep. I don't really care what they eat as long as they're eating something. Alice 3, how are you doing? Are you getting any bigger yet? No. I don't know how long it takes them to go from one size to the next. That is not something I know the answer to. I could look it up, but I'm not going to. Here, let's knock out these walls now. I love all these sculptures that we have going. I think that's really funny. There's a turtle. We're not going to bother the turtles. Because of course we're not. Okay, that's a much nicer room now. Okay, so to kind of remind ourselves what's going on here. So why are we as a bunch of tribals turning on a spaceship? So we con got contacted by the AI Corps that said that, Hey, guys, uh... If you come and turn me on, I'll take you to some planet that's never had civilization on it. It'll be pure and unsullied. And our colonists are stupid, and they said, okay, 
just trusting this superhuman intelligence that once they flip the ship on, that it's totally going to do what it said that they were going to do. So, an infinite chem reactor? Where's that? I've never gotten one of those. It's not that far away. Ten days? Oh, there's a Manhunter pack. Um... Hmm. Okay, I tell you what. I'm not going to record ahead here. I will wait until tomorrow. Should I go for the chem reactor or should I flip on the starship? Probably the first person to say something gets to pick. We'll do one of those two right at the beginning of next episode. So, until then, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.